Hey everyone, and welcome to the Chris Carver channel. What you're looking at back there is a male and female pink convict cichlid. They are in a little ceramic pot in the very back of this little uh, enclosure that I made for them in my 55 gallon. Had to make some unexpected uh, moves. I took my um, flower horn and because he didn't have any color on him, I moved him to my 125 and instantly he became brilliantly colored. He's getting along with the Texas cichlids, the other convicts, the jewels, he's getting along with everybody. So I might keep him over there for the time being. That's the male convict there. And they are in the process of breeding. So I thought I'd do a tutorial on the breeding cycle of fish. So basically what I'm gonna do is over a period of next couple weeks, I'm gonna do uh, separate videos included onto this video. So it'd be one big video of how these guys actually go into the breeding cycle. And then when the eggs hatch, how they move their babies around, how the babies get a little bit older, et cetera, et cetera. So I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. So uh, stick around, watch to the end of this video. Hopefully um, we see some really cool stuff here. Okay guys, a couple days later here, and she definitely has eggs. They're up against the side of that um, that pot, if you can if you can make out. I know this is kind of hard. I didn't Let's see if I can see it in a different way. He's of course he's going to stay in the way, but yeah, she's in the the ceramic pot watching over the eggs. He's watching over her, and yeah, the first stage is over with. Well, actually, the second stage. First is finding a place to live and a place to uh, lay eggs and then actually laying the eggs and fertilizing them. And that's what they've been doing. So yeah, that's the second part. I wish I actually had better lighting where you guys could see all those, but it's gonna get really interesting very quickly. But uh, anyways, <clears throat> that's the second portion there. And uh, I'll keep you updated here as they start hatching. All right, we're at day four, day five now. I'm not too sure when they laid the eggs, but they're back there in the back. She's guarding them. Uh, and they actually hatch, so they're out of the egg and they're stuck to the sidewall of that ceramic pot back there. And you really can't see them. You're not gonna be able to see them until they come out of there and they start swimming. What's going on here? Am I invading your turf, bud? He's like, yeah, come on in here. I'll show you what time it is. Yeah, he, the dad doesn't like me getting too close to these guys. Can't say I blame him. Mom's in there just looking over everybody. Yes, I see you. He normally comes down inside this and gets in my way. Like he wants to block all footage like he's famous or something. But anyways, there he is. Like I said, this is day four, day five-ish. And the next video I do, I'll do when the babies come out. And there he is going in there to check on him. All right. Be back in a sec for you. Okay, this is about six days after she laid, approximately after she laid. Um, I could be off by a few days, but she has moved all the babies up to this part of, let's see if I can zoom back out here. They were down there in that pot and she moved them up here in this little bitty area Oh, you can see them. There's a few buzzing around up there. You can see a few right there that are just buzzing around. And she takes them and she shoots them all the way in the back of that little cave there. And uh, Dad is keeping watch right here in front. He really gets annoyed with me videotaping. Right? But <clears throat> that's the next step is them actually coming out of the egg and moving around a little bit. Uh, probably the next step was going to be uh, them actually coming out of that little cave and swimming around the mom and dad. So let's see what happens there. We'll see you in a little bit or a couple days. All right, so it's been two days since the last part of the video. And since then, she's taken the babies and moved them back to the original spot back there in the pot. And uh, today she brought them back up here to the cave. And as they're wiggling around and learning how to move, they're falling down here in this little pit. 
and she's going down there and getting them, collecting them and bringing them back up to here. And if you look very carefully, you can see them all back there. They're buzzing around, moving a little bit. I think that's a little better view. That's the babies about a week after, uh, a week after I noticed they laid eggs. And that's mom. You can tell by the pink stomach. That's how you tell on convicts. For those of you who didn't know, even on the black convicts, the females have pink stomachs like that. Kind of, uh, kind of almost like a hologram. And the males don't have that. So anyways, there's the next chapter of the babies moving around. And there's dad. Proud dad. And next part of the video, I'll show you as they're actually swimming. So, see you in a couple days, or in a couple seconds. And this is two days after the last part of the video. There's Dad right there. There's Mom right there. And right back in the back, you can see all the babies. They're no longer buzzing on the floor. They're actually swimming. There they are. Kind of blurry in the background, but as soon as they come out of their nest there, I'll get a better shot of them. There's Dad being protective. There's quite a few of them. And there's their little home. And I'll do an updated video, maybe in another day or two, when they're out and roaming around the tank. Very cool stuff. All right, see you in a bit. All right, couple days later in the last part of the video, and as you can see, the babies are all around the nest area. They're kind of just everywhere. And mom and dad are close by, keeping an eye on them. If they get too far, they collect them in their mouths and shoot them over here with the rest of the kids. So as you can see, they're all back there in the back. And last night, I didn't get it on video, but the parents here almost like took them for a walk. There was a big ball of babies, and they went all the way down here, and then they went all the way back. And now it's kind of like playtime around the nest area. Very cool watching this happen. Now, the next time I do this, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take that pot that's in the back there and I'm gonna put it right here so that we can see from uh, the start of the egg laying to when they hatch to when they leave the nest. So I'll have that a little bit better for you next time around. I really wasn't prepared for them to do it this quickly. But all in all, this is really neat. And this is what you get when uh, you have a mated pair of just about anything. And they have an entire playground here to mess with. So I might do an update on the babies later on, but as far as this video goes, they're out of the nest. And I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, be sure to comment below. Be sure to share, like, and subscribe to my channel. And uh, let me know what, uh, what you think. Thanks for watching, everybody.